guys welcome back to my channel my lovelies so this is going to be a daily reading for you guys and for those of you who've been giving me that constant support and who's been there for me throughout my journey thank you all so much for all of your support guys it really means a lot for you to be there for me and thank you all so much so if you are new to my channel and if you feel like this reading resonates with you guys please make sure to like comment and subscribe to my channel because that would really help me grow myself and also help a lot of you out there okay so let us just start off with the reading now so this is just going to be a general reading uh, anybody can watch it anybody can um, what to say you can watch this is a timeless reading at first okay so i'll just be giving you a timeless reading for all zodiac signs now for how this person thinks about you and how they feel about you right now and after i give this reading i will be giving you all a daily sign wise reading okay so if you clicked on to the cancer reading and if you come across this first it's okay you can watch this and it will resonate with you this is going to be a reading for how this person thinks about you how this person is going to feel how are they feeling already how are their emotions going to change towards this connection for you how they were before and how they have changed and everything about this person generally okay and if you don't want to watch this part that is okay you can skip it and move on to the actual reading okay so i will give the timestamps in the description or i will give it in the comment section or if i didn't give the timestamps in the comment section please guys some of you please help me out subscribers and please comment uh, down below what you think and what you feel about the reading and everything so let me just start off with a reading of how this person thinks and how they feel about you guys how they feel about this connection with you how do they feel about this connection with you guys? Wow, so we have the humility card. I know this, um, the whole setting has changed and we have this small plant here, the small cacti variety here. We also have satisfaction, spontaneity. So, what i can see of how this person thinks about you how this person feels about you is that especially so what i can see here with a humility is that you have developed the loving awareness that you and everyone else are the same but on different parts so today is a day where this person feels like maybe you both have the same destination but the path that you're progressing towards the path that you're moving towards is maybe different okay so maybe you need to maybe the separation if you're in a separation state or if you're in a committed relationship and if you feel like this person's not very clear about this connection you feel like they're cheating you at times it is mostly not because this relationship is not meant to be it is because maybe this person has to face more other karmic cycles before coming towards you completely or you have to face another karmic cycles or set of karmic cycles before you come uh, into this union with this person so that is the main reason why this relationship might be getting delayed so just don't uh, be negative thinking that this is not meant to be because this person totally understands the soul of this person wants to tell you that everybody you, we both have the same path but that i mean we would have the same destination but maybe we have to go towards different paths and kind of reach at the same destination okay some parts may be rough some parts may be fine good but still we need to carry on towards our path go towards what we want to do and kind of get to the point where we achieve something out of life so that is what this person generally wants to say that is how they feel definitely about this uh, connection with you and yes guys this is all i can see here for you with a humility card okay this person generally understands you completely they finally understand that you both maybe had to go in separate parts to kind of come back in this union okay so that is how this person generally thinks that is how they feel and yes uh, we also have the satisfaction here so this satisfaction card is all about 
giving love it is all about you let the energy of love guide you to self approve so others no longer define who you are so this person definitely feels like they need to create a definition for themselves they need to create a strong um connection with themselves before they make any progress towards a connection with you so this person may be very very they are very much concentrating on creating something for themselves so that when they come towards you it is not like they're depending on you okay so they don't want to be depending on you they don't want to um what to say guys they don't want to do anything that is dependent they want to be independent in their own energy and they're really working towards their independence really working in life so that they can do whatever they have to for themselves okay and this is a really not a toxic connection like if a person is wholly dependent it may be toxic okay but i can see here that completely this person is not toxic okay So that is again what I can see here guys. This person doesn't want any kind of a toxic connection. They definitely want to be with someone who can uh do good to themselves, who can earn for themselves and they expect the same out of this connection. Okay, so if you are going to be this person who expects a lot from them, if you're going to be this person who is uh what to say guys? was expecting who were who wouldn't own for themselves or who wouldn't do anything for themselves then you might uh, make this person think that you're not good enough so yes you have to also start your own um things change so that is again what i can see here for you with the satisfaction with the spontaneity you move beyond the constraints of the mind and freely and lovingly embrace new situations so the spirit guides and angels i don't know whoever is watching this reading the spirit guides and angels want to tell you that no matter how irritated you feel or no matter how um, mad you feel or maybe you're not feeling good at the moment just keep everything aside okay you don't have to think about everything continuously and kind of like make yourself confused all the universe wants to tell you is that you need to you need to try to embrace new situations embrace new changes in life you don't have to simply be this person who is constrained with certain thoughts constrained with certain feelings no don't do that because this will really not help you encourage yourselves okay so all the universe wants to tell you is that you need to try to embrace new situations new love opportunities it is okay because maybe you've created some cycles that you need to go towards that you need to focus on this person is trying to kind of like go towards certain cycles complete certain karmic cycles get that done with and then they can come towards you in a free way okay because if you if this person is not going to completely um what to say guys completely let go of certain energies or complete certain cycles it is not going to happen for them okay so that is again what i can see here for you guys with the spontaneity and yes uh, thank you all so much for joining me here my lovelies and Bye guys see you all tomorrow and also guys after this this is going to be like a general reading for your zodiac signs so if you are a scorpio then this is uh, going to be like a general read i mean general reading for scorpio zodiac sun sign and um just watch that if any other signs scorpio and the pisces taurus virgo capricorn aquarius libra gemini or leo aries sagittarius any sign okay so i will be giving the reading for that now and see you all tomorrow if you don't want to watch that so bye guys Guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Aries. Thank you all so much for joining me here, Aries. This is going to be your daily reading, Aries, for your general energies and also for your love energies, Aries. And I'm really sorry for all of those background noises because I'm not uh, doing the reading indoor today. I'm doing it outdoor because I'm not in my place right now. I'm in my native place, and I thought to do the reading outdoor because indoor is much more noisier. Guys. 
guys so let us because all of my relatives have come here so yes let us start off um, with a reading we have the temperance we have the king of swords so with the temperance and with the king of swords all i can see here that temperance is a card that comes up when there is a lot of changes happening in your life so this is a card uh, which means that there is going to be a lot of changes in your life there is going to be a lot of things that you need to understand and today is a day where you will not um, be in a situation but there is no equal give and take of love so if you feel like this person is not giving you the love that you always wanted if you feel this person is not supporting you or not like um, being however they have to be with you then definitely you will uh, go out of this situation so i hope you understand what i'm saying so you want an equal give and take of love from the situation otherwise you're going to go away from this person okay so that is the overall energy that i can see for you guys here that i have for you guys here with the king of swords again i can also see that uh, today is going to be a day where with the king of swords today is a day where you need to understand things completely you will do everything according to your expectations you know what you're supposed to do you know what you're supposed to manifest and you're probably going to do that correctly okay you're not going to think about it a lot of time you're not going to uh, be this person who's always thinking you're going to be someone who does uh, things in action so it's going to manifest certain things in his or her actions so that is also what i can see here and today's a day why you will not give any kind of um any kind of like what to say guys you wouldn't make a wrong decision today and today's a day where you wouldn't let anyone ill treat you only if this person gives love you will be giving love so if they don't give love to you if they are not kind to you you would definitely never be kind to this person you would not give love to this person so you want something that is mutual okay so, and they want something that is mutual too and with the king of swords this can be a little bit of a rivalry going on between you both because you both want the same thing and you cannot understand each other maybe there is a lot of misunderstandings to be honest there will be a lot of misunderstandings when two people are exactly alike and that is what is happening in your situation so yes guys see you all tomorrow bye guys my lovelies bye